now at 9. Online and on TV, I'm Don Hasbrook. And I'm Jeff Herndon. Put the baby making on hold. The new trend in affordable miracle medicine. Imagine having a son or daughter 50 years from now. Women who are worried about their biological clock are freezing their eggs now more than ever. One company just into Chicago is hoping to make the very expensive process more affordable with new egg freezing financing. My hope is that I'm going to walk out, walk out of this building and knock into Mr. Wright, but um, that probably won't happen. 34-year-old Leah Jane Levine is freezing her biological clock. She wants babies, but... And it's not something that is really that important to me right now. My career is. And she's not alone. The Centers for Disease Control reports that in Illinois, the number of women having their first child in their mid to late 30s is up at least 30% since the year 2000. And first-time moms in their 40s has risen at least 40%. For many moms-to-be, freezing eggs is a type of motherhood insurance policy, but it's an expensive one. Enter Egg Banks, a national company announcing its expansion into Chicago at the Hotel Monaco tonight. A new network of doctors here who will now finance the freezing. All egg freezing procedures are elective, um, and it can get expensive. Uh, the normal uh, price for egg freezing is $15,000, and so through egg banks, you can finance that and get the prices down, including medications, to about $250 a month. Dr. Allison Rogers of Fertility Centers of Illinois just signed up as a provider. Well, by the time women hit 40, they only have 3% of the eggs that they had originally. I really hope that this will make this process a lot more attainable and achievable for patients. Leah Jane just got her two-year financing package with egg banks. Maybe it's just not in my cards to be a mother, but that's the option that I have, and now I don't ever have to worry about it again. And Dr. Rogers, who you just saw, says by the time women hit 40, they only have 3% of the eggs they originally had, so there are less eggs that are on top of that, not great quality. And she recommends that patients consider freezing their eggs before they are 40, which a lot of women now are obviously choosing to do. And we asked on Facebook tonight, would you consider freezing your eggs? Jennifer says, no way. I'm glad I'm young enough to be able to enjoy my kids and keep up with them. And Maddie says, I am enjoying my grandkids, my childbearing years are over. I'm enjoying my golden year. And Nicole says, I tried to be responsible and wait until I was financially ready, but if I could do it all over again, I would have started younger. And Brianna chimes in, I plan to adopt. Plenty of kids out there that need a home. I don't feel any biological need to produce my own.